Hello everybody. Yep. You can see I got my minion hat on. That means I'm going to be underneath this uh, Ford again. It's, it's actually a nicer day today, so I'm probably going to get a little bit more done. But, I was watching on uh, some of the live chats and stuff like that. People are talking about the C6 transmission, and there's a lot of questions about these big old things. There's a secret to them, and uh, I don't know, it's one we stumbled upon. Uh, the C6 is actually a very, very good transmission. They're strong. They're really, really strong. But they have a big drawback. And it, it like everybody mentioned in there, they run hot. Uh, I'm not a transmission guy. I can't tell you the ins and outs of them. You know, all that technical stuff. But I do know that they uh, run Type F uh, transmission fluid only run type F in them. If you run anything else in them, they're a slush box. They're, they don't perform whatsoever. They have to have that heavy, hard-hitting uh, transmission fluid in them. But, in their torque converter, they run under some extreme pressures and they're pushing a lot of fluid. And because of that, in those tight little passages and everything inside of them, they run hot. They run really, they get really warm. So, if you're going to run a C6, Ford knew this, you got to run an external oil cooler for them, plus the one in the radiator. You do that combo, you'll never have a problem with a C6 Ford transmission. Here, I'll show you. You see, you got your typical outlets here. You see me take those lines off. And I saved all those lines over there for the reason for the reason of reusing them. And that little fella right there, that's your transmission cooler. Your tranny lines come out from the transmission. They go through this. This kind of pre-cools it back down and then goes into the trans into the radiator portion cools it again and then runs back to the transmission on every c6 we've ever used let me get that sun out of there that's the key to them we've always added that external in them and after doing that we've never had a problem with a c6 and they shipped very very good very hard very crisp just if they start getting a little warm they start getting a little sloppy and then they overheat and they burn up like the common thing you know theme with the Ford C6 that you hear the problems with <laughs> can all be solved with an external cooler all right hope that helps meantime I'm gonna jump back under this Ford here and get the motor and transmission out of here before it snows uh, in two days. I got two more days. All right. So, meantime, keep that metal hot.